everybody, how's it going? This is Matt from Snooze Central. Today we're going to be talking about a pretty interesting flavored snooze. Now, in this snooze it has two flavor profiles that blend really well together and it produces something that's really unique and tasty. Uh, I like this one so much so that I'm down to one portion, so I gotta bang this review out here real quick. This is Polar Stark White from Scroof. Let's take a look at the can, let's look at the portions, and I'll tell you a little bit more about this interesting snooze. Alrighty, so taking a look at the Scroof Polar Stark White can, this is, uh, this is a really cool can. Now, on all the other Scroof cans that I've seen, um, they're pretty much similar to this can here. But I really do like the, uh, the, the profile and the shape of this can. It's really squared off. It's not rounded on the edges. It's just a really uh, nice, beefy-looking can. It's got the, the silver all around the can. It just makes it look really sharp, really uh, space-age-looking, space age and uh, unique. On the top, you're going to find the traditional screw size catch lid, really reminiscent to those older uh, size catch lids. Uh, but plenty of room to throw in any of your used portions, so that's really nice. I like the blue font that's up on the top there, and uh, it just it sets it really apart from a lot of the other cans. It's, it's something that really catches your eye. Around the side of the can, it has these really cool raised dots that uh, give it a little bit of texture. And as you can see there, it's got the, uh, the nice blue screw font there with the nicotine strength up top which is, it is a Sterk, so it's going to be a, a stronger than uh, normal portion. But this is just a really sharp looking can, guys. See Polar Stark White again with the, uh, the nicotine level there on the side. Just a really, really cool looking can. On the back, as always, traditional Swedish warning label, your expiration date, and ingredients. Really nice looking can all around, guys. I, I think this is just... Uh, something really sharp and uh, I know I've said that a lot with with a lot of cans but they just put a lot of styling into uh, a lot of different Swedish snooze cans and I think it's just really really cool something to add to your collection so don't throw these cans away because you never know if they can uh, if they can become a collector's piece one day so let's go ahead and take a look at the final portion that I have left in here because like I said I've been enjoying this quite a bit Taking a look at the portion, it is a white portion, and it is a slim portion. So it's going to fit very comfortably in the upper lip. Uh, no really uh, form of irritation that I found on these, but I would suggest drinking some water with it because it can become uh, quite dry. And I found that on a lot of the, uh, the screw uh, portions. They can dry your mouth out a little bit, so as always, drink water with them. But the, the bag material is really nice and soft. Uh, again, not too much irritation on the gums, and it's just really nice to have, you know, a, a slim portion. It, it really makes it easy to snooze, very discreet, and uh, just a little bit more comfy in your upper lip. Pretty nice stuff. So that's a look at the can and the portion. Let's go ahead and uh, pop one of these in, and I'll tell you a little bit about the flavor profile. Alrighty, so flavor profile on the Polar Stark White from Scroof, like I said, is pretty unique. And, uh, you know, there's two really popular flavors in Sweden. There's eucalyptus and licorice, and that's what this snooze offers, is a eucalyptus and licorice flavor. Pretty unique. And uh, I gotta say, I've been enjoying this quite a bit. And this is probably one of my morning snoozes that I go to that I'm, I'm really enjoying. Uh, another really good morning snooze that I'll probably do a review on later is the uh, the Sunfresh from Scroof. That's a really good snooze as well. But um, flavor profile, uh, like I said, it's going to be an awesome licorice and eucalyptus flavor. Now, if you don't know what eucalyptus is, um, when you when flavor wise, when you pop it in, it's going to give you like a cooling sensation, like you would a mint, but it's not really a mint flavor. Uh, it just gives you that cooling effect. But it's backed up right away by that really awesome licorice flavor. It's not a strong licorice flavor, but it's definitely there, and you can definitely tell that it's a pretty good uh, flavor. It's it's really unique. It's, it's a snooze that I find that I get about 30 minutes of enjoyment out of at most. Um, I'd say 
realistically though, you're gonna get about 25 minutes of flavor out of this. But it's still a fantastic snooze. Um, the nicotine is a stark, so you're definitely gonna get a good hit with nicotine. Uh, this will wake you up in the morning, but it won't put you out on your butt, so that's a, that's a, good, uh, that's a good thing there. The nicotine will last you the whole time they're in, and like I said, it's a pretty strong nicotine strength, so don't worry if you're jonesing for nicotine, because this will do you in quite well. It's just a really unique flavor, uh, something I've never had before, and uh, something I really enjoy. If you're a fan of mint, if you're a fan of licorice, especially black licorice, because that's what the flavor is on this, give this a shot. You might really enjoy this one. This is also pretty good with uh, with a coffee, too. So if you if you like coffee in the morning, or maybe like a strong black tea, this is pretty good with that in the morning. Um, this could be an all-day snooze, too. So if you like that, that minty-type flavor, or the minty sensation in your upper lip, that's another good, another good choice. Really solid, uh, solid offering from Scroof. Really like this one, and uh, I'm sad that I only have one portion left, so I'm gonna have to order some of this soon. Thanks, guys, for watching. If you have any questions, as always, please feel free to leave them, leave them in the comments section below. I'd like to know what your favorite morning snooze is. What, what is the snooze that really gets you up and going in the morning? Uh, for me, it's this stuff at the moment. Really good stuff, guys. You're really gonna like it. Pick up a couple cans or a roll. Um, you know, it's it's just a really solid snooze. Thanks for watching this, guys. Hope you guys have an awesome day. As always, again, please leave some comments down below. I'd love talking to you guys. And uh, I'll see you on the next snooze review. Thanks for watching, guys. Enjoy your snooze.